Did you know a Soviet scientist accidentally killed himself with his own biological weapon? In April 1979, Dr. Nikolai Ustinov arrived at Compound 19, a secret bioweapons facility in Sverdlovsk. He was working on weaponized anthrax, one of the deadliest substances on Earth. The lab had triple containment systems, pressurized suits, and endless safety protocols. Nothing could go wrong, or so they thought. During a routine experiment, a tiny needle punctured his glove. Just a microscopic amount of anthrax spores entered his bloodstream. Within days, he felt like he had the flu, fever, chills, nothing serious. But then his lymph nodes began swelling to the size of golf balls. His breathing became labored as fluid filled his lungs. The government quarantined him immediately, desperate to contain their secret. As hemorrhagic fever set in, he bled from every opening in his body. His organs shut down one by one over four agonizing days. The man who perfected the weapon became its first victim, 